Evesham Township Police are looking for two women wanted in a church theft. They say that hundreds of dollars worth of items were stolen from a donation closet. I went to Sue's reporter Shante Lance is live in Evesham Township with more on this investigation. Shante. Jessica, nine minutes. That's how long church administrators say it took two female bandits to rummage through and steal from their donations closet. She's going through the coats, as you can see. Thieves caught red-handed on surveillance video inside the Church of St. Jogues, stealing three $25 Kohl's gift cards, laundry detergent, and four newly donated winter coats meant for children who need them this holiday season. It's a shame because um, our pastor is very instrumental in helping the poor, and so are we. We would gladly give anybody anything. Uh, if they would have came in and asked and they were needy and they needed some coats and needed some food, it's here. We, we would give it out to them. Parish Administrator Mike Rocco was called in to check the surveillance footage on Veterans Day after a staff member noticed the items missing in their St. Vincent de Paul donations closet. To his surprise, two women and a small boy were seen on camera on Sunday, November 10th, entering the church. They walk right into the closet. One woman starts grabbing items in the dark. She later turns on the light. Then you see both women grabbing coats and opening boxes. They walk out with trash bags and place them in the trunk. An outside security camera was able to zoom in on the white four-door Nissan's license plate. Once Evesham police released pictures of their faces, Rocco says they reached out to the church. They came forward and tried to call us in the office, but I didn't speak to them yet. During our interview, Evesham police returned to the church after hearing word that the women would turn themselves in. We're told they never showed, but police say the stolen items were worth about $460. Rocco just wants them returned to donate to the neighborhood children. If they would return the items and we had them, um, and then we would go from there. And, you know, we're a Catholic church, so we're forgiving. But church administrator says this is the second time this church has been hit in 12 years. The first time a man was caught stealing a flat screen TV. Live in Eastern Township, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Shante, thank you.